Okay guys, finally it's that time. You've been hearing me talk about uh, this fluid film uh, way back when I started the rust repair on the dually. Uh, well here it is. This is what it is. I'll open this up and show you in a second what uh, what it actually is. Um, that's what it is. It's, it's basically um, like a grease. But you can see it's non-toxic. Um, non-hazardous. So it's not like I'm uh, mixing up a bunch of oil, spraying it in my rockers and letting it drip all over the place. Um, I got uh, the kit with a gun here. This is supposed to be specially uh, designed to spray the, the fluid film. It was a spendy gun, about a hundred bucks I think for this um, gun. I just got my regulator from my paint gun on there so I can adjust the airflow. Um, it comes with a regular tip on it. And then also you've got a two hoses here. One's got a standard tip on it that just sprays it straight. And then you got a 360 degree nozzle, what they call that. So that will spray out 360 degrees, which is what I'm going to be using inside my rockers. So I can spray the whole top, bottom, everything. Um, comes with three of these jars to fill up. This is what uh, you're going to screw onto the gun with. It's basically going to suck it out, shoot it out the hoses. Um, so that's what I'm getting ready to do. Um, there are access holes in the um, rocker panels in the back where you can uh, spray this stuff. And I've got one here so that I can uh, get in there and get behind some of the braces that are in that cab corner there. So I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna get this can open. I'll show you what it looks like in the can there. And then um, start filling these bottles up. And then I'm gonna start spraying. Okay, so here it is. It's got uh, kind of an odd smell to it. It's um, not like a not like a terrible smell, but actually, it kind of reminds me of uh, like a showroom kind of smell. Um, kind of like a maybe like a new smell or something. I'm not sure, but it's uh, that's what it is. And uh, I'm gonna start filling up these jugs. And we're going to start spraying this. Alrighty, locked and loaded here. Uh, I think I got everything adjusted right. Got me 360 degree nozzle on here. Um, you got an adjustment here of how far you turn this in. Depends on how much stuff comes out. Um, also the pressure. I'm running at 40 PSI. Maybe a little more. Um, you got to adjust this to to set it to however much you want to come out. I was just over at the trash can and I figured out, um, I think I'm at where I wanna be at. So I'm gonna start spraying the rockers here, see how it goes. Um, okay guys, so I'm up under here. I'm just gonna show you one last thing. There's a hole, there's one of the holes for the inner rockers, but you're gonna, I'm gonna stick my hose in. Um, there's another one there. And the middle of the rocker, buddy. And then we've got uh, another one up front. And those are the holes I'm going to be sticking the hose in and um, spraying the fluid film. So um, most vehicles have these on the inner rockers. And um, I'm, they have the holes there, but most of the time nothing gets sprayed inside them. So I'm not sure why they even put the holes in them, but there's plugs on them holes too. I, I pulled the plugs out, but there's plugs on them holes and uh, you gotta pull the plugs out to, uh, to be able to get in there because the factory puts a plug on them. So I got the plugs sitting somewhere. I'll, once I get my fluid film all in the rockers, um, I'm gonna put the plugs in there and she will be. Okay, I just got my passenger side done. Really nothing to show you because everything's inside the rocker. 
Um, I think I got it good. The uh, only thing you can see there is a little bit of grease there on the, or a little bit of fluid film there on the, on the BL. I did spray inside this tube. You can see the 360 degree nozzle there. It, I just stuck it in the tube and you spray it as I pull it out. did that a couple times. Um, I did the rocker. I did each thing like three times just to make sure I got a good coating in there. Another thing about this fluid film is it's supposed to like creep into um, areas. So um, even though you didn't spray the area, if you get a good enough coating in there, it should creep into all the nooks and crannies. Um, so you don't have to actually spray every nook and cranny. Uh, it will uh, it will creep into all the nooks and crannies. So I really didn't use all that much. You can see how much they got done. They got used in there. Uh, I may hit that one more time. The rock, or just to, I don't think it's gonna hurt nothing to get a bunch of extra in there. So I might hit that one more time before I uh, move to the other side. Um, so I'm gonna move to the other side pretty happy with the way it's spraying. There's the nozzle again, 360 degree nozzle. That's probably all I'm going to use is the 360 um, for what I'm doing inside the rockers. So I'm going to continue on and uh, I'll be back. Okay, so I'm going to give you an idea what I'm doing here. This is why I put this hole right here. Because this makes it so much easier to get in there. Spit the hole, holes in, I'm going to push the trigger and pull it out. Okay, all done. Really didn't take all that long. Uh, you can see there's my plug. Got all my plugs back in. Got the factory ones back in. Um, hopefully that's going to stop the rust for a long time to come. And, uh, you know, actually if I, if I had a new vehicle, um, probably fluid film would be the first thing I'd spray in all the rockers. Um, all the, the fence side defenders, probably the bottom of the doors, around the rear fenders, you know, the fluid film, it's, it's cheap. It's really not that expensive. That gun I said was $100, that was the most expensive part, but the fluid film isn't that expensive once you got the gun, so. Um, yeah, there it is. All fluid filmed. Um, I, I feel better knowing that there's a... Uh, a, a greasy substance back there more so than not so um, getting closer here only got a few things to do and I can actually drop my bed back on so um, really getting close here um, I guess that's it guys uh, fluid film seemed to work pretty good Got to clean up my mess here. Didn't use a whole lot either. So I'll have enough for um, a few other jobs if I want to. I may go under there and uh, coat the inside rockers with the fluid film. Um, just because I got enough here. And um, it's not going to hurt anything. Yeah, It's going to probably... Uh, it's going to get dust collected up under there because it's kind of greasy, but I'd rather have a, a dusty rocker than a rusty rocker, so I may end up doing that too. So I'm going to end this video, guys. I'm doing a lot of talking, and um, I'm pretty boring, so uh, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.